Hi everybody and welcome back to my kitchen. Today we're going to make a low fat quiche. Um, something that's healthier for you. And um, I hope you enjoy it. Alright, in the this big bowl I've got a cup of chopped up ham, a half a cup of chopped onions, a cup of um, grated cheese, and down in here I've got about three quarters of a teaspoon of rosemary. You can use thyme. I chose rosemary. I'm going to add um, I'm going to add a quarter of a cup of flour. And it doesn't matter if it's self-rising or on purpose. It, it just doesn't matter. I'm going to stir all these together. Preheat your oven to 400 degrees. Get all this stirred up. All right, in the bowl over here, I've got three large eggs, and I'm going to beat these up till they're uniform. You know, you don't want streaks of white in it. You want to get them well mixed, well combined. Which I think that's good right there. Alright, and to that I'm going to add a cup of low fat buttermilk. Buttermilk. Not sweet milk, buttermilk. Get these combined. And instead of mixing this in the pie tin, you're going to get your bowl of ingredients that you've already put together here and you're going to pour this in. And you're going to get it all mixed up together. And the reason we're doing this is because of the flour that's going to help uh, coagulate this butter, this uh, buttermilk, and make a nice firm quiche. All right, now I made my pie crust. You don't have to. You can buy one. Here's my pie crust. We're going to pour it in. I'm going to try to get every morsel out of here. <clears throat> and you're going to bake this at 400 degrees anywhere from 40 to 60 minutes. If the center, when you look at it, if the center of it is wet or um, more than wet, still raw looking, it is not done. So, here we go. Put it on a baking sheet just in case it overflows. And then uh, when it gets done, we'll be back. Alright, welcome back. Quiche is done. It took mine about 50 minutes. But, um, you know, you'll have to go by your oven. Yours may take longer or shorter amount of time. And, of course, I've got Sam here who is going to be the taster. I am a professional eater. And he's hungry, so I'm cutting him about a fourth of the pie. <laughs> That's her secret. She waits till I'm starved. I've never had a key before. Well, we're about to try this one. You are. Mm. 
Can you all <laughs> see that? Doesn't it look delicious? It sure does. Let's see what Sam has to say. Go ahead, Sammy. Look at that flaky crust. This crust... <laughs> this crust is my friend Nikki's grandmother's crust recipe. And it's very flaky. If you all would like to have that recipe or see me make it, let me know. If I don't hear from you, then I won't because I've put a lot of crust recipes up, but I've not put this one up. What do you think, Sam? I think it's delicious. The crust is delicious. What has it got? Ham, egg, cheese, onions in it. Mm-hmm. It's, it's delicious, isn't it? All really, right. and the crust is extraordinary. Great. Okay, guys. I hope you try it and make it. And I'm trying to get it, get you inside there. Mmm. Whoop. There we go. Give this a try. It's not hard to do. You saw what all I did to put it together. Um. I hope you do try it and like it. Thank you for coming in today and spending part of your day with me. Please like and subscribe if you haven't. And until next time, take care.